What's going on guys? Welcome back to the episode of Tech Store Simulator. Last episode we made a ton more progress in our store here. I know it's been a while actually since we played this, so may forget uh, some things, but we got a new shelf added, we got some new products added in here, and uh, trying to get some organization done in the store here. And also there's been some major updates to the game since we last played. Also, we had now a new we now have an update for the storage room that actually gets us a full size storage room, and now it actually just when we do update or upgrades for that, we just basically add on more shelves that go around the room here like that and uh, we also have a new thief as well that is in the game so we got um quite a bit extra that is new here and everything and we are going to continue on where we left off and try to get some more products unlocked here so you guys can see we have um 4500 dollars over there with all of that but anyways if you guys do enjoy this and want to see some more of this be sure to drop a like in the video show it some love and support and if you guys are new around here checking this out be sure to hit that subscribe button down below so you don't miss out on any videos that we do that we are doing here because we are on the road to 5,000 subscribers which at the time of recording this we're really close to hitting 4,400 so we're not even that far off from 5,000 we're actually almost we're almost ha to the halfway point between four and 5,000 which is just insane it really is because it feels like it wasn't that long ago that we hit 4k and now we're already getting close to that 5k mark with that which is just Un unreal mind-blowing to me it really is but <clears throat> anyways we got to continue on can we remove labels yet it doesn't look like we can it's okay i was gonna say it's not even giving me the option to pick it up but yeah it is now so yeah we need the ability to be able to remove labels but we need to get opened up here we've been closed long enough here and we need to get some stuff ordered on in here because uh, we are hurting on a lot of products with all of this but i really do enjoy this game so i'm excited and happy to be back in this honestly because this one is a fun one for sure. But yeah, we need, like I said, we need to get some products ordered on up here. I don't know if we're going to be able to afford everything, actually, because it is quite a bit that we need to order. Um, Actually, we can. Okay, we still have $1,000 left. We should have, where are there? Oh, right, wait, that's right. I think they all quit on us, didn't they? But we also have a new security guard that we can hire here, too. So we are going to be doing, wait, no. Employees is what I want. I know they're supposedly still here. So it's just they're not here. I don't understand why that's still an issue with that. It's actually kind of annoying, honestly. So we are gonna have to Oh, here's our security guard too. Okay, I'm just gonna go to main menu and then we're gonna go back to continue. Hopefully fingers crossed they load in with all of that. Oh, there they are. Okay, we're good. Hopefully we didn't lose any products off of that, but if we did, it's not the end of the world. It it, it is what it is. But yeah, I would like to get some new suppliers in here today, which we need to get some more expansion. I think that's something we also did in the last episode is we expanded the store a little bit because it's actually pretty cheap um, for all of that. But yeah, we have also, you guys, we have some new arcade machines. That is something that is new. I forgot to talk about that. Um, we have, I'm trying to find where, you know what? We actually might have the other ones already unlocked. Yeah, there's one already unlocked. And then there's supposed to be three. There's this one. Oh, there's this guy, which we have too. And then there's this one, which we'll be getting next along with the self-checkout. So I'm really excited about that. So we should be able to get that in here. We don't really have, actually, you know what? We do kind of have some space. We got some space right here that we could do the arcade machines. I just need to find where they are. <laughs> I honestly haven't. Oh, it's probably in furnitures. Nope. Decorations. Oh, there they are. Okay. There we go. So we have arcade one, which is $500. Let's go ahead and add that. And then we got arcade two, which is uh, $1,500. So it's going to be a little bit expensive, but it's going to be well worth it for us to check out, which, like I said, I... I absolutely miss enjoy this game. It's just taking a backseat to some of the new games we've had come out lately and uh, keeping up with everything here. But um, there we go. So we have $20 to our name here. Let's get these on out and then we can... There we go. Look at that. Yeah, let's get these bad boys set on up right there. Looks like we can't do anything with it besides just grabbing it. So let's go ahead and get this guy placed on down. This is pretty cool. I like this. Some old school arcade machines. It's They're pretty expensive, honestly. But they should generate some revenue for us also with that. As long as people actually start playing them. Uh, something we need to look into doing here too is actually getting another... Well, actually I was going to say getting another register. But at the same time, we're going to be getting a self-checkout here. Wait, do they... I was going to say, do... Are they, being, the de, being decorations, do the arcade machines people not play... But yes, they do. I was like, I swore... I actually want to take a look at the Steam page real quick. Um, just to see this update one more time. Just to be sure. 
Um, yeah, it says we added a new money generating feature. Now you can buy arcade machines, put them in your store, and sometimes when customers will play them and generate some additional cash. So yeah, they do generate re revenue for us. It's just going to obviously take a little bit of time to get them paid back. But um, that'll be well worth it for us here in the future. But anyways, we got to get $3,500 because we need to get um, the next next supplier in here for us. And then we'll be all good with all of that. But we got to get some more products ordered on in here. I would like to try to continue to get the store reorganized even better. Yeah, we're gonna. I was gonna say we're gonna be way short on money for that. We can order this stuff at least here, and then we'll be good to go after that. There we go. Okay. There we go. There's some cha ching, cha ching. I love hearing that. That is so cool. But yeah, we got. We kind of reorganized some things a little bit in the last episode. I would like to get things, like I said, really nicely organized, but. It's going to take some time for sure. So I would like... Oh, jeez. A little bit of lag there or something. But yeah, it's nice. We have, again, some new updates for the game. Just some, some major updates between adding our new um, security guard here. we got to get old Willie taken care of here, which is 5k. Obviously, I'm not too concerned about that quite yet. Which, actually, wait. What was the last... Um, some explosive... <laughs> We're going to give that tech shop a send-off. They won't forget. Boom. No more competition. You'll be the... Okay. So, I kind of... I, I kind of want to check that out, but it's going to be probably a little bit because I would like to get at least the next supplier in here before we do that, which is $3,500 for, yeah, this guy right here, which gets us a self-checkout and the final arcade machine right away, too. So, I would definitely want to do that. But we also have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven new items in here, which I don't know if we have space for... Um, I mean, I guess we, we got one, one space right there, two spaces, three, four, we got like four spaces right now, so we might need like one more shelf in here, we also need to order some more new products, some more products here also, because we're probably out of some things here, I'm going to have to close down the store at some point, try to restock things up and make sure that we're all good on everything, uh, we got a couple of these that we're going to need. And some of these. And we're still short money. <laughs> oh, geez. We started this off so so good with uh, so much money. And I thought we were going to be excellent for money here today. But I guess not. We spend it so quick. But that's all right. We also make a, make a pretty decent amount, I'd say. Uh, we're minus 100. Okay, we're minus 77 bucks. Come on. Can we get can we get a bit of money here? There we go. I want to see. We've had this sitting here, I think. Oh, maybe not. I actually don't even know where this is. I've lost touch with like all of our stuff in our store here. Of what is what. It's been been quite a while. Excuse me. It's been quite a while since we played. So I'm just trying to make sure that we actually have this stuff. Yeah, it's these run <clears throat> those right there. Okay. Anyways, that should be good to go right there. Got a few more products coming on coming on in. Um, let's see here. Also, I want to check our, I want to check to make sure that our prices didn't change at all. Let's take a look at any of this. So that's all five and 10, eight and 13. That's all looks good. 12 and 20, 12 and 20, 10 and 15. Just want to make sure, like I said, that we are all good on all these pricings that we're not like either underpriced on something or, um, over way overpriced on something. Yep, here's our... It looks like you're getting... Oh, what? We're getting robbed? Where's he at? Hey! What, what did our security guard do there? <laughs> we got him, though, at least. Yeah, take him down the street. <laughs> That's right. I don't understand what our security guard was doing then. Why did he just, like, sit there and leave it? He just, like, let it go. Um, okay, well, we obviously have some sort of issue there with the game getting bugged a little bit. And I'm trying to just put this box back. So let's just throw that on the ground there, I guess. So, what? our security guard didn't even do anything. He didn't even stop him. I don't understand that, but alright. Well, I was just trying to look at our pricing and then we just had that happening. But anyways, <laughs> we're good. We stopped him. We shouldn't have to. That's why we have our security guard. But anyways, that's all right. Um, let's see where we're at for our shop then. Or our items here. 
I would like to just keep a healthy supply of like everything, but we need to we need to make some more money before we can do that. <laughs> Ooh, that was close. Okay. Just like that, we have fifteen hundred dollars extra. I love hearing a little cha ching cha ching though. It's pretty sweet. I like it. Can we get can we get someone to buy one of these so I can get this on the shelf here, hopefully? But that's alright. We'll figure it out as we go. Oh Willie, what are we doing? I'm kinda hoping he goes away after um taking care of that last and final mission with him. <laughs> Um, but yeah, so that's right. We've got headsets here. We got keyboards there. We got some of the PC components here. We got microphones up here. Uh, we got some RAM here. We got our mouses right here. Which honestly, these should. Wait. Oh, he did just. Oh, so our I he so he doesn't grab the item though at all. So that's a bit unfortunate, I guess. We gotta actually be mindful of that then. So we're just going to have items scattered around outside. Oh wait, this actually might be able to go back. Oh, we can. I didn't even... Okay, so we're good, actually. Never mind. We got that back there, at least. But anyways, okay. Let's uh, let's see uh, see upon our, our stock again here. See what we need to order here yet again. We're slowly saving up some money, though, which is good. Got to build that money up before we can... Actually, we're, I mean, we're not great on a lot of things, but we're not bad either on some stuff. Um, does it, I forget, does that get us a new shelf? I think that did, didn't, or maybe not. No, it doesn't. Okay. So we got a lot of big box items there as well. We got a, we got a webcam there also. And I don't know, we got a router, digital scale. We got, so we got some new house, basically, actually a lot of new house, like house stuff, which honestly would go along. Bro, can we, can we stop with the stealing of things? <laughs> I really don't like it because now we gotta be running outside all the time trying to um, check up on our items that are missing out there. But um, yeah, you recommend it to your friends even though it gets robbed all the time now. <laughs> okay. Um, anyways, so we need another new shelf then. That is something we're gonna need. And I th honestly, I. Th hey! Buddy. I was clicking. I was clicking the wrong button there. Yeah, I kind of don't like the... I hope that gets changed a little bit. I think there's... It's a little bit too much of a spawn rate for those guys. Like, he just was here, and now he's already back here trying to steal again. If only our security guard would, like, grab the item. That would be a little bit better for that, but that's all right. It is what it is. Um, is. Let's get... I guess let's try to restock some products quick here before we try to get, before we get robbed again. Oh, jeez. Anyways... Got some of these. We got one of these. A couple of these and some of those. And there we go. At least this with three thousand dollars. We need again another shelf here, which honestly what I think I'm gonna do here is let's let's actually move like our housing products back over here and then we'll do another shelf right there. And that kind of opens that up for another shelf there. Oops. So furnitures. We got our big shelf here. We're gonna get another one of these in. Oh, we actually I don't think we have we don't when did we get that? That's a new shelf, actually. I don't think we can hold as many items with that, so I don't know if we're going to check that out quite yet. I think we're going to leave that alone for now. Let's grab this. Let's open this on up. I think we're getting robbed again. I think... Was that him right there? Yeah, it is, isn't it? Maybe not. I thought it looked like the same character. There, okay. Anyways, so yeah, we got um, we got enough shelves in now for the rest of our products, which I think what we're going to do is once we get enough money, like I said, we're going to actually close down the store so we can try to get some things restocked up in here and make sure that maybe reorganize a little bit here too. My days. What do we do? I mean, I appreciate our security guard. I'm really glad that we have him. Otherwise, we'd be losing a lot of items here. Because I would be not be realizing that we're getting robbed as often as we are. When we are. But, um... Wait, do we not have... Those keyboards aren't going anywhere else, are they? No, okay. Yeah, we don't have anything extra in here. Yeah, I think we're just going to try to make a bunch of money here. So what we can do is, like I said, we can get the actual license in here. And then actually try to reorganize things a little bit. 
That's kind of my goal for this if we can. Um, let's get some of these in. Get some of these. All right. So that is that. Now I'm like trying to keep an eye out for him. I guess I'm glad we have our security guard here because he is actually doing a good job for us. Other, excuse me. Other than he just doesn't grab the items for us, which is fine. But um, yeah, I'm just keeping an eye out for him now. But yeah, I hope that I know this was introduced to the game like actually probably a week ago or so at this point. Maybe a little, maybe a little less than then. And so I'm actually kind of surprised it hasn't been tweaked at all. Is there any kind of setting that we can adjust for? It doesn't look like it. I was going to say, if we could, like, adjust to, like, maybe turn him down just a little bit or something. But that's all right. Um, right. Let's see here. I feel like we have a lot of open shelves. but it, Did I just see somebody over? I, maybe not. I, just, I keep on... I'm, like, freaking out, man. <laughs> I'm, like, uh, freaking out thinking that we're getting, getting robbed constantly now. I keep on seeing like people like sprinting off in the background, it looks like, and I'm PTSD, man. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, there we go. Just keeping an eye out for them. For them dang thieves, man. But yeah, like I said, I feel like we have a lot of open shelves here, and we don't have a lot of empty, like, I don't know. It just feels like a lot, a lot of open space in here. That's so, why, like I said, I'm just trying to get, we're going to get a bunch of money uh, saved up if we can to get some more products ordered on up here. And then um, close down the shop so we can have products actually not flying off the shelves. And then we'll... Sir, are you robbing us? No. It's the same character, isn't it? I'm pretty sure that is. I don't know how much also we're making off these machines. They're, they're nice to have, but like I said, I don't know how much we're making off of them. Um. Anyways, I feel like we're not making that much money, though. Feels like we're just spending it constantly. We're not going anywhere. I mean, I guess we probably could honestly get rid of like one of our stalkers. But it is nice having three of them also at the same time. So if we are trying to order a bunch of stuff, we're not like constantly um, getting short, I guess, of them while they're working. It is this character, isn't it? I'm just going to keep an eye on him real quick. Yep, it is. I knew it. He's trying to... <laughs> no, he's just... <laughs> yeah, like I said, it seems like he spawns way too much, too often. I kind of would prefer for him not to be here all the time. Like he is, but it is what it is. It's all part of the game. We're just going to have a huge pile of boxes outside at some point when we forget to grab them after a while. Um, there we go. So that is all that. Okay, we're starting to build up to like that four plus thousand for items there. I guess, honestly, we could probably, well, if we purchase a license, as a supplier license, we're going to be having people asking for, for the products. So we don't want to be having that. So we're going to make a bit more money here because, well, you know, let's just purchase the, it is what it is. Supplier, let's purchase it. Because I actually want to see how much the uh, like self-checkout and stuff is to... So there we go. We got all of that because then we can also get our products pricing adjusted here too right away at the same time while we wait. Oh, it's like a vacuum. I see. Okay. So what have we been doing for $100? We've been doing $130 for that. So $130 for that. Same for that. We got another guy coming in. Dang it, dude. Yep, here he is strolling on in. Can I just kick him right away? Yep. I was ready for you, bud. Not getting away this time. Not even getting out of the store. Uh, $50. Okay, so we got like... Like 65 probably for 50 we've been doing. I'm just trying to see what we've been doing here in the past. Just try, try to keep things kind of consistent. Okay, that we have a lot. Holy crap. $80 for... Okay, well maybe we'll, tr maybe we'll try 80 then. And then we'll do 80 on that also. Do like 90 for that. And then like 160 for that. There we go. So we got all that priced on out. Uh, we've already, again, got all of our... Let's see here. 
Like I said, I would just like to try to get some of our stuff kind of nicely organized if we can here in the store. And then we got all of this stuff here that's actually pretty pricey. I guess we could start getting some stuff in here. Yeah, we need another $2,500 for all of that in here. Just to just to get the products in here then. Um, okay, I was going to say I really hope that made its way into the storage room because that's actually a really expensive item. And I did not want to be losing that. Okay. So anyways, there we go. We got all of that. Um, let's see here. Yeah, we got a lot of other stuff. We got to try to get caught up on here still too. Just being paranoid, watching where he's at. Yeah, I don't know. Like I said, I don't really like having a feature there. I wish that we could have like a security thing, like a, like a metal detector kind of thing. Or whatever, like the security pole things would be standing up there so we could at least like, I don't know. Or our security guard would actually like stop him constantly and pick up the items because I feel like he's still getting away with some things. But maybe not. Maybe that's just me being crazy. He's just sitting over here like arms spread out. <laughs> okay. Anyways, uh, we need another 440 bucks. And then we can order the rest of this. Then we have everything in here at least. We just need to get it out on the shelves then at that point. Oh, here he is. Yep, he's coming strolling on in here, nice and slow. Just gonna get my kicking leg ready. There we go. We got him. Alright. So yeah, that goes right there. Yeah, like I said, it's kinda it's kind of annoying, honestly. I kinda hope that we um not get it taken out. I don't mind having it in here, it's just when it's con when it's like as often as it is, it's really kind of annoying. To have that going on all the time like it is. But it is what it is. Um, let's see here. So we need another 900 bucks, and that'll be everything then um, for the store. And then we'll have everything that we have at least unlocked in here. Uh, come on. Okay. Okay, now the shelves are starting to look a little better with all of that. So I would say we're pretty pretty good with all of that. Except for these. These shelves are not looking too good. Yeah, we got a lot of stuff that we're missing, which I guess is probably part, part of what we're ordering here. Not all of it, but that's fine. We'll get as much of it in as we can here. And continue on rolling with things. Um, okay. I also want to see, where is the, um... Yeah, self-checkout. $1,500 for that. Okay. That's also something I would like to try to get in here today if we can. Again, it's, that's very expensive, very pricey, but we're going to do our best here to try to get that in if we can. I feel like that'd be kind of helpful. We could actually maybe get rid of our cashier at that point. $5, come on. All right, we got somebody at the register. There we go. So there's all of that. So we can get the rest of that in on in here. Again, the box is just being <laughs> carried. I think it's, yeah, he actually has it. It's just... Not quite showing up right, but that's fine. Um, tch -tch -tch. So what if we were, honestly, what if we were to, um, what if we were to get a self-checkout terminal in here and then we fire our cashier? Because we can, yeah, we can pick up this um, cash register. We could actually stick that right here and maybe actually even, maybe we put one right here. And we see how it does. Maybe that's the play to do. We get that in here and see how that does. We got all of our new items in here. We still have to get actually out here. Which, honestly, I could get out because some of this stuff we know right where it's going to go. I'm just kind of waiting around to see what we do with things here. So we can open this up. Let's get that down there. Honestly, yeah, let's get some new, I new items in here. At least for the, the home stuff. Uh, we got this right here. Let's open this on up. There we go. We got yeah, an iron right here. We got a vacuum. Okay, so yeah, let's grab all of this. There we go. And then all we have left is a router, 
a webcam and a digital scale, which honestly the scale would fit over there too, but we don't really have the space for it. So that is all right. We got, no, we're good. Okay, I'm not seeing any items out here on the floor, so that's good anyway. We got quite a bit of money though, so let's go ahead. Obviously, we gotta we gotta get more. Um... Oh, whoops! I was like, wait, what? Yeah, we're good. So we got our first self checkout in here then, which is awesome. Oh, this thing's actually a lot smaller than I was expecting too. So there's that. Now we can have people go into this, sir. You can go to self checkout. It's open. Let's see what um what that'll look like now. Oh, we got a new email. That's right, I forgot we actually had a new one at the beginning of the episode too, or the beginning when I loaded in here, and I never never actually looked into it. Um, no. No. Okay, so it looks like we literally have just a bunch of scam of things. We got just salaries here. Okay, so literally just like a bunch of scam and a bunch of spam emails, <laughs> just like real life. But anyways, there we go. We got, um, I want to see how fast they are. Okay, they're actually pretty fast, honestly. So you know what? Let's, um, sorry there. You've been, you've been good to us, but we can pack it up and we can sell it for 50 bucks. So let's go ahead and sell it. Let's get just one more self checkout in and then we should be all set. Fully replacing our um, employees with self checkouts now. We can open this on up, and then we can get another one placed right here, like that. And there we go. Now we actually have even more space in here too, and one less employee to be paying every day. How much did that uh, save us? One hundred fifty dollars a day. So I mean that it's not like a ton, but it, it adds up. So I'd rather have the. It, it will take us ten days to pay for a self checkout, and I think that's gonna be well worth it for us. For that over time. But anyways, we got to get some more products in here. Let's see here. How much do we need? I, again, I would like to get... I would like to close down the store. And get some stuff re, um, reorganized and restocked up. Yeah, we're definitely not going to have enough money to order all of these. Because, yeah, this is a lot. Uh, honestly, we're not actually far off. We're, I mean, 1700 That's enough, but it's not like a ridiculous amount. Let's, I guess, just take some stuff out of the cart towards the bottom so we can get that stuff ordered up. Wait, there we go. Exactly zero dollars. Okay. Yeah, look at all those items there. Wait a second. Did he... Okay, we might have just kicked him for no reason there. <laughs> I know he's been stealing stuff, so... Just maybe wasn't there, but we kicked, <laughs> we kicked him for a good reason there. Okay. Anyways, yeah, we still have three more new items to get in here. We just... I want to be able to close down the store so we can get some stuff actually um, organized in here with this. So let's see. What are we missing here? We made some really good progress here today, but nonetheless, so we got some new products in. We got our... Um, oh, that's right. We also have the other uh, machine in here, too, that we can do now. $2,500. We're short. Uh, $9. Okay, so there's some of that. But yeah, what is... So $3,000 to the arcade machine. We're definitely going to be getting that in, but it's just going to be a little bit before we can do that. So I want to get the store, I guess, organized and reset up here a little bit before we, um, before we do anything. Again, I know the arcade machines is just free passive income for us, so it's well worth it to have. It's just going to take some time to get there. At the very least. So let's see where we're at with more products here. Again, just trying to get some stuff stocked on up. Um, let's see. Yeah, we're definitely not going to be able to afford all of these. But I'm just trying to, again, see where we're at with stuff. Here we go. We're getting some more in, though. Definitely doing better slowly. Just taking some time. <laughs> it's just carrying an empty box. But it is what it is. Okay. Let's just keep on going with things here. Keep on getting more products ordered on in the store. 
Got zero on that. Zero for that. Yeah, we are really hurting for stuff here. Come on, $70. That's all we need. There we go. Okay, a few more things back on in. And again, that's all we need to do is just keep on stocking things up as much as we can. And we'll be good to go here slowly. It's just gonna just gonna take a little bit of time, but it's fine. Um let's see. So I'm just trying to make as much money so we can get some at least enough to get everything stocked up on stocked up in here and then try to get some organization done uh, from it. So let's see here. Got nothing of that. Nothing of that. Nothing of that, nothing of those. Yeah, we're definitely, again, not going to have enough to order it all, but just trying to get as much as we can here. Just remove these. You got, you need 44 bucks. But yeah, I think it kind of helps us at not having the employee, the um, cashier pay for us. I haven't heard the, ugh, of the guy getting kicked in, in a while, so I don't know if, We could just, <laughs> we just call this an idiot. We could just kick random people too. Doesn't have to be the uh, the robbers. That is actually really funny. Um, wait, can we? Wait, I just realized we can't even move our own computer here, our own desk. I didn't even realize that. I didn't even think to try and do that because actually that would be kind of nice to move that right over to here or something, or even out of the way a little more, something like that. But yeah, let's see here. Um, need some of these. I mean, look at, think, I just thinking back at where, where we began with this and how many products we have now compared to what we had before. It is insane. Come on, $63. $63. That's all we need. And then we can get another set of products ordered up and then we'll be probably one or two, one or order away from having everything in here. And then we can actually get the store organized a little bit here before we wrap things up. For this so let's see I mean, we got constantly people in here and that is so nice wait oh um his head's a little <laughs> where's the item that he took though I think we just lost that whatever he took so either way he got away with it technically that's actually really annoying Unless he just kicked him for no reason like we did before. <laughs> but I'm not seeing anything. So I think we lost whatever he took there, which, I mean, isn't the end of the world, but a little bit annoying. Uh, let's see here. Again, I'm just trying to get everything stocked on up here as much as we can. We need some of these. Need one of these and one of these. And that is, we're two or three short, and then we should have everything here. So we should be able to actually clo do what I want to do here, close down. Which I know we should be doing that in the middle of the night, but there we go. There's 47. We have 47 bucks left after ordering everything there. That should be about everything that we have and need in the store, at least of one thing. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, we got just these three thing, three extra things that we still need to get out. I just again, I don't want to place them out until we're ready to go with everything here. Hmm, okay. Let's see. Anything else that we need to order here? We got some of these. And we got some of these also. Let's see. Oh, some of... Wait, I thought we just ordered those. Didn't we just... Maybe not. Maybe we went through them already. I don't know. Maybe we literally went through them that fast. I'm not too sure. I wish we had the ability to pause our pause the stalkers so we could get the... Yeah, we still can't. Hmm. Yeah, I wish we had the ability to pause them so we could actually... Um, so we could actually hit, like work on organizing things without the worry of them trying to move stuff around on us. But that's fine. All right, I think we're about ready to go here. I'm just going to check to make sure that we have everything in here. And we've got a little bit extra cash if we need to order something just in case. Oh, we got these we're missing. This we're missing. 
Okay, that is about everything right there. We got a little bit extra cash. I think we're going to close down the store here. And then I think we should be about good to go to get everything stocked in. Oh, we got... Okay, so we can just kick him before um, before he even does take anything. <laughs> That's fine. Okay, let's see where we're... Oh, we're at zero for these. That's fine. That's again why we had some extra cash. Got zero of these. Oh, dang it. We got zero of an another expensive product. Okay, we have just enough money. Let's get these on in. And then how are we looking on the shelves here? Honestly, not too bad. I feel like... Oh, we have those right there. And then we have these right, right there. Are we missing the mouse pads or are they bringing them out? It's fine. Just go on and get. <laughs> okay. I feel like we're missing that mouse pad. Is it back in the... No, it's not back in the storage room at all. Okay, let's see. We might have... I mean, we might have just sold one. Didn't realize it when we were counting again. It says that we have two, eight, and four for the mouse pads. Unless, is that just somewhere else? Maybe it's just somewhere else. Hmm. Oh, you know what we do? It's right down there. Okay, so I want... Yeah, that's... See, again, this is why I want to get things organized here, because I want to get that moved up to there like that. So we've got all of our phone cases and such, along with a charger. Actually, our chargers, phone cases right there, so that all works. we got mouse pads, and I think that's like a hard drive kind of thing. Like that, we got our toy cars, which actually we could probably... Actually, you know what? I think I wanted these up here. And then, yeah, let's do... I'm just trying to figure out what we want to do here real quick. So let's grab... Oh, what else would we want up in here? We got a webcam and a router kind of thing. Honestly, the webcam could actually go over there. That would kind of make sense like that. So, yeah, we got, or actually, you know, let's do that. Let's move these mouses here, like that. We've got an, an, an empty box here now that we can move these over to here. I just wish we had a, a, the ability to clear off labels. That's the only thing we're missing with this right now. These should go over here, like that, and then... What else do we need to move here? So if we put, we got the router, which actually our digital scale that could go right there. I know as soon as I drop this box, they're just going to come grab it, aren't they? Oh, maybe not. I guess if we put it on the shelf, they don't. Okay, so we'll get our digital scale there. So we got like more kind of housing stuff, which honestly might go over here, potentially. We got all this stuff already all taken care of. Um, so again, we got chargers, phone cases, we've got, honestly, those, sh well, I guess that's all right for now. We're still going to have some more stuff to move around anyways here in the future. And then we've got to get these cleared off, that cleared off, and this cleared off. So that's part of the problem is we need to just be moving some stuff around here still, and we don't have the items to suffice it to clear them off. It's part of the issue. Um, and then we got a router here, which, whoops. Hmm. Trying to think. I mean, I guess that could go right there. So there's that. So all we have now extra is just that shelf and that shelf right there. And what is the next set of items in here that would, that would go in the store here? Let's see. So we got 5k for these, which we got a lot of new items yet again. So we'd probably honestly get another one of these big middle shelves when we have the space. Or actually, I mean, it could go right here. It, it was, it's definitely going to start to get a little cramped in here with all of that. 
but we just need the ability to be able to, be able to remove the remove the labels. That's all we need. Because again, now that's going to get filled up with more items. Maybe what I'll do here is just so we have. Let's just do that. These I'm just going to move up here. Like this. And then I'll just put those right there. And then we know that we need to remove those with some time. I'm honestly going to, I'm actually going to save an empty box. Just so we have something to be able, be able to move. Actually, you know, let's save two just in case to be able to move stuff around with that. And there we go. So we got everything kind of nice, not nicely organized, but I would say organized a little bit. We got new self checkouts in, which is awesome. We got new items in, which is awesome. The new arcade machines, which is awesome. We got a ton of progress done here today with all this. So things are looking really good here with this, but this has been a very long video. So we're going to, we got to wrap things up here with this, but if you guys enjoyed this, be sure to drop a like on a video, show it some love and support. And if you guys are new around here, checking this out, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below. So you guys don't miss out on any videos that we are doing here, but we're going to come back in the next one. Um, I for sure want to do some more of this because I really do love this game. It's a lot of fun. We're going to keep on working towards some new items in here. We might get another store expansion, which, um, upgrades. Yeah, we've got, uh, right here is going to be our next one for a thousand bucks, which looks like that fetches us just a little bit of space. So we might want to do both of them right away at the same time. So that would be 3000 for both of those, just so it's even. Otherwise, it's going to push this half of the wall back just a little bit. And uh, it's going to look a little strange there with that. But um, yeah, so like I said, we're going to keep on working on some new products, new shelving and everything as always. So we got to get some decorations in here too to kind of spruce this place up. But anyways, thank you all very much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed and I will see you on the next one. Peace out, guys. Thank you.